Oh my god, it keeps getting better after a certain point. What's happening? Oh, no way. Oh, 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 oh. Why do any clothes just uh, have the uh, gauntlet and the cape, right? I cannot take it anymore. My hair on my hands is standing up. <laughs> friends welcome back to my channel today i'm so excited to take a look together with you for the first time at the brand new legendary avatars in lost ark costumes it's an event for those of you who are new to get legendary grade costumes in the game and um th this is really nice because they they generally put in so much effort and these costumes that are legendary and come so rare are so unique in Lost Ark. I'm on the Korean website right now and uh, uh, when I saw this page, because I did see this before but nothing else, I, I thought to myself I need to have this on video because I'm already just so excited about this. <laughs> I can feel that already some of you are gonna say that I am getting paid by Amazon games, but I'm just excited. How can you not be excited? Look at this. So anyway, these are the brand new legendary avatar costumes. We're gonna take a look at the video after we look at the costumes themselves. Here we have them in a static picture form. This is the one for, we start with the warrior classes. This is the gun lancer, pretty nice. I always wanted to, to play dressed up as that character that you meet in Bairn throughout your Lost Ark story. This is nice, it looks similar to that. A little bit over the top though. It has so many things going on for it, especially this white version. In black it looks a little bit better, a bit more clean, if I may, because the details kind of fade away a little bit, so that's nice. Next we have the Berserker. I have this feeling that I've seen similar before on a Berserker, and I'm also not a huge fan of the um, color combinations that are being advertised here. Nonetheless, I believe it looks badass and I think that in-game it looks pretty cool as well, like a like a Lord of Mordor kind of feel to it if you if you really look at the mask I, in game i believe it looks really really dope destroyer we have a very nice pose i love it when destroyers hold their hammer just casually this huge hammer that is as big as them with one hand to the side right and um, the suit itself fits them i i like this more and i also like that there's not too much of this blue in it right just a little bit here on the waist in the eyes uh, and here on the shoulders, this is really, really nice. And also blue fits a destroyer very, very well. They have a lot of blue looking skills. Their innate is like a, a huge blue thing. So this perfectly uh, fitting for a destroyer in, in my opinion. Very, very nice. Wow, this looks like some sort of an alien, but not the one with the, you know, the big head kind of thing, but like a cool humanoid type of alien. So nice. This is beautiful. And his shoulders and the, the, oh, the gloves. Absolutely gorgeous. 10 out of 10. So this one so far for the Paladin, <laughs> absolutely beautiful. This is, this is really, really good. So next we move on to the fighters. This is the striker. Very fitting for the striker to have this lynx kind of tigery mask. Super nice. The colors also are just beautiful. White is very popular these days and for some reason it fits him so well. Also dressed up with the gloves and the gauntlets. Oh, oh no, no, not these hats I love. I'm so down for the Asian conical hat that you see here. I cannot even tell you. The costume itself is also really beautiful and imagine this in Lost Ark. Maybe they're gonna show it in the video later on, right? So we're gonna watch that absolutely as well. Um, but just saying this is this is really, really nice. This is very nice, very well done and absolutely loving the hat and the gauntlets i guess mm, maybe so and so not that much wow this is also nice look at what nice gauntlets they've made for the infighters actually and the costume itself very very nice very nice for the infighters as well and a little bit of an eye patch here which uh, i don't know if i agree with the eye patch and the shoulder maybe instead of the feathery shoulder we would have had these kinds of fins which look a little bit more metal uh, you know, the same kind of shape, but yeah, just saying overall a really nice work for the infighters as well. Soul Fist is something that captures a lot of the beautiful 
um, Asian culture. I really, really appreciate the colors, the vibrant colors that they've put into it. What, you, you know, I, some of you might look at this Soul Fist outfit and say, hey, if he didn't like the feathery shoulder and the masquerade eye patch for the infighter, why does he like this? You know, it's different. If you're a soul fist, you are different. This is a different kind of class in Lost Ark. And I really appreciate the way they captured the Asian vibe and culture that a normal person would imagine. Um, maybe more towards Chinese than anything else. Really, really nice, very beautiful. Oh, the Lance Master also got the, uh, some sort of a resemblance of a, of a um, Asian conical hat. This is so beautiful. And the costume itself with the thicker waist and longer belt, absolutely beautiful. I love, dude, I love this. I love these conical hats and the way it fits for, uh, for both Battle Masters and uh, Lance Master, absolutely gorgeous. In terms of, hmm, Okay, so this, same as the Berserker, I feel like I've seen it 11 times before. Artillerist gets something that, again, sure, I've seen it before, but it's so cool that I want to see it again with, with the mask and the hood. Very, very nice. A little bit of, you know, mechanical power over here and the weapon is also pretty nicely done. Uh, this particular version with the actual blue and black and the overall feel, I wouldn't get for myself, but this in white is something nice and feels new-ish. It feels interesting and uh, yeah, sure, I, I, this is nice. 10 out of 10? No, not really, but nice for sure. Next one we have the, oh, look how much detail has been put into the uh, sharpshooter. A lot of detail has been put into this armor, the cape also, leathery with a little bit of, 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 of uh, spike resembling things at the end. Super, super nice, perfectly fit for for um, for a sharpshooter. The bow also very nice, but maybe the bow I've seen before. This in white and black and white, gorgeous as well. You don't even have to dye it, right? Next one we have, oh my God, the people wanted, so people wanted the Scouter to be Iron Man. The Scouter is Iron Man. Man, this is so nice. This is this is so badass as well to make a class that everyone calls Iron Man into Iron Man in a way. Super, super cool. I like the fact that they didn't go full Iron Man, right? With like a, a full metal suit as well. But just the fact that there is this mask that cover. Wow, this is so good. This is so good. Both colors look absolutely gorgeous. Look, <laughs> look they even have the middle, you know, the, the, the core. Oh my God, the gunslinger, please. Wow, this is so beautiful. This is so nice. Again, I seen it before, sure. Not even only in Lost Ark, in other MMORPGs as well. But this is so gorgeous that you have to see it everywhere you go in all your MMORPGs. This is beautiful. Next one, we have the Bard. Wow. Wow, this, this is never gonna come in the West. She basically doesn't have any clothes for the lower half, right? Because this is not a skirt. This is part of the blouse, the sue, however you call it. Uh, even this is opened halfway through. And not to mention the fact that there's just under this is just underwear panties and that's it so uh, I don't know if Amazon is going to bring this exact thing over I don't mind it personally but I'm just saying you know westernization the process so this looks really nice with a little bit of a crown also on top bards are queens of lost ark after all so it fits them perfectly fine I really like the outfit as well I really like it very to the sexy side um, but it's really nice the harp fits very well with the outfit the thing from the harp with the thing from the shoulder and the colors also absolutely perfect very nice job on the bard as well oh wow oh i can imagine this in game i know that many of you that are new might not be able to imagine how this looks in game but i can tell you this looks stupendously good in game because we've had similar kind of costumes before for the summoner in arcana uh, and oh my god this looks so wavy and flowy and oh this is gorgeous oh wow 
talking about sex in bar, they went all crazy with Arcana. I mean, Jesus, why, why, why do any clothes? Just uh, have the uh, gauntlet and the cape, right? Um, very nice, really, really nice. Oh my God, it keeps getting better after a certain point, what's happening? This I absolutely love. This is for the blade. Oh, wow. Oh, I I just had an idea. I, I would play a blade just to look like this. I'm just going to say it as I feel it. This is the best skin legendary avatar from this 2021 set that we've seen so far. It has nothing extremely special about it. But man, does it look good on her. 11 out of 10 for this one. Oh, no way. What is happening? What is going on? Why? Oh. <laughs> From the face mask, to the neck piece, to the chest, to the shoulders, to the sleeves, the torn apart cape at the bottom. <sighs> and the glaive this is such a, a rough cut of the weapon so raw so brutal so caveman like you like you carved like you carved a stone you dipped it in some blood and then you 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 just smashed on top of it like a like a metal ah this is oh, should i re-roll my summoner into an assassin main this is also really nice. I mean, what am I supposed to say? Look at this rubbery feel of, of, of a costume like it's latex, but you're an assassin with the, with the straps on the legs and on the arms also. The mask. My top three favorites out of Legendary Costumes 2021 have to be number one, the Death Blade. Absolutely no discussion about it. This is so simple, but is so perfectly fitting with the class and the style that I just I just have no words to describe it. At number two is pretty tough, but but I am going to go with the Paladin. Oh God, this is just unrealistically good. And then at number three, another assassin, um, the Shadow Hunter, which is gorgeous and badass as all things combined. This is my top three, but there were so many other good ones. Um, good job for the 2021 avatars in Lost Star. Let's quickly watch the video as well. This is a one minute video. We're gonna play it here in, in YouTube. Let's see if they show us some animations. Just kind of how they look. Mm. Oh, that, that Gunslinger one was so good as well. Oh, 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 my, my insides hurt. And look at this matte kind of black. It's not like the Assassin black, which is latexy, rubbery, shiny. It's, uh, it's nice and matte. Look at, look at the Paladin with it also. And even the Gun Lancer. Oh, God in heaven. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. So why I paused the video right now be is because of the Lance Masters pose. I cannot take it anymore. My hair on my hands is standing up and I just, I'm unable to take this. Look at the... Mmm, Lance Master's pose is, oh, so good. This Scouter costume is just... <laughs> I'm sorry for nerding out on you guys. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, amazing.